What's going on guys, it's CJ aka Dato aka Gorax and I'm back and I'm doing another review. Now this time I chose to do with my custom blade that I got from Calamasil. Uh, my brother bought this for my birthday uh, a couple years back and it is held out true and strong. Uh, there's a few nicks and dints and cuts in it, I think you can see them there, there you go, that dark section there. A lot of these are actual uh, bits of armour that have pierced into the blade so uh, as you can see it's definitely held up. It's still very flexible. Uh, I've never really had any problems with any of my color muscle weapons uh, breaking. The handle is Clovis. Um, as you can see, it's got a lot of uh, engravings and everything to make it look different. Uh, the handle itself is also quite flexible. Uh, you're not really going to have any issues with this. But I did find that the, the handle itself was a little bit slippery for my liking. Uh, so I added in the leather strapping just to make it a little bit more grippy. Because uh, I have lost this thing a few times in battle and uh, someone's knocked it out of my hands. Uh, but the, the blade itself looks amazing. If you have a look at the detail on this thing, it's insane. Uh, I'll show you an image of what it actually looks like without the leather strapping. Now moving on to the blade itself. This thing is awesome. Um, this is the Rusted Blade by Kalamazoo. Uh It's 100% rusted the whole way through so it's not like it's only half the section uh, but you do have these patches which I think is awesome where it's solid steel it's not rusted not bubbly like the rest of it you do get these sections where it is quite uh, clear I think that gives the sword a lot of character and I'm a big fan of how they've done that instead of just doing the full thing as rusted they've, they've put the patchwork on it which I think makes it look a lot better uh, it lets you build character from the sword so you can just say that this was your father's sword and he handed it down from generation, 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 all that sort of thing. Uh, so it gives you a lot of options to work with with your character. The weight of the blade is awesome. It's uh, not a heavy blade. I don't know the exact specifications because it is a custom piece. So uh, I do believe the blade is 68 centimeters from memory. I can't remember 100%. Uh, and obviously I don't know the weight of the handle and everything. When you swing this thing, it, it's got a lot of weight to it. it the blade's heavy, the handle's heavy, everything about this is heavier than your regular swords. Uh, so with this one I feel like every time I swing it I'm actually going to do damage with it. So that's something that I want. I don't want to sort of swing around a piece of paper and a bit of tissue at people. I really want to actually swing and hit someone. Uh, obviously not to hurt them, but I want them to know how you just got hit and uh, this is where it came from. But I haven't seen anyone else with this, so if you are looking to get a new blade and you're willing to spend a little bit of extra money, I'd suggest going with the Calamessil Custom Weapons. Now, don't pick the Clovis handle with the Rusted Blade, that's mine, back off. Uh, but definitely go with something else. You can get Rusted Blade, you can get Rock Blade, Emerald Blade, Regular Steel. Uh, anything you want and then you can get different handles so you've got uh, bone handles uh, orc handles elven handles dwarven handles roman handles they've got everything there so everything can be sort of mismatched and uh, slapped together and it looks amazing uh, every single time you can pick the length of the blade make it shorter longer whatever you want to do uh, within reason obviously but all in all i think this is a really good buy if you are looking to spend a little bit of money and get a new blade Definitely go for a Calamessal uh, weapon and definitely go for a custom if you want something that everyone else isn't going to be walking around swinging. We've all seen the Novice Sword, uh, we've all had the Novice Sword and we've all probably put that thing through the ringer. So it's about time that you upgrade and you get yourself something manly, something cool and I definitely suggest custom weapons. So again, thanks for watching guys. I will see you on the Friday Fields and hopefully see you at Quest. See ya.